Now, the biggest spotlight right now remains in Texas, where people are dealing with extreme cold temperatures. Yeah, the winter storm is straining power facilities. They are leaving millions of people in the cold and in the dark for days. Some people are staying in their cars, trying to stay warm and cha charge their phones. And on top of that, many are dealing with burst pipes. This morning on Fox 59 Morning News, I spoke live with my sister Belinda, who is living in San Antonio, Texas. She says officials are telling them to just wait it out until the power comes back on. I don't think anyone here really imagined a winter storm quite like this. We just, we weren't prepared. Um, I've been without power since Sunday night and the water shut off on Monday night. So it's, it's tough not having electricity, but to add you no know, water on top of that, I mean, that really puts you in a tough situation. FEMA is now stepping in to distribute generators across the Lone Star State, but there's only so much the federal government can do. Texas is the only state with its own power grid. The company that controls most of the state's power is working around the clock to try and get it back up and running for everyone.